My name's Diane Layback, and I'm the author of The Last Woman in the Forest. What inspires me the most to write would be anything that makes me feel, whether it's a beautifully written passage in a book, um, incredible movie. One of my favorite movies is Into the Wild about Chris McCandless. And I think just anything in life that makes me feel, whether it's a tragedy that's happened, whether it's something good, and I want to find ways to capture those feelings with words and communicate them to, uh, to an audience. My advice to struggling writers would first be don't give up. And next, I want to paraphrase something that Toni Morrison says about write the book that you want to read. Be true to yourself. Um, and also, imagine, don't create. Because when we create, we're forcing something into being. We're manipulating something. And instead, try to imagine it. Try to hold a visual image of something in your mind. And then look for the words to, to capture that image. I don't handle writer's block well. I find it's pure agony. I, first, I try to read, and particularly read short stories. Oftentimes, that'll lift the writer's block. But if it doesn't, I remember something I did with my sons. I have three grown sons now. But if I wanted them to open up to me or to get them talking, I would engage them in an activity, such as shooting baskets or throwing a baseball, going for a hike. I've reminded myself of that. So when writer's block hits and nothing's working, I will go work in the yard, I'll clear some trees, I'll shoot baskets myself, I'll do something that is physical. And once I've engaged in that physical activity, if I'm carrying sort of the shadow of my book with me or the shadow of my characters with me, I find that then they will start to speak to me and I can get the answers I need to move forward.